Fake, a little fake, a little fake. <laughs> Please welcome Henrik Lundqvist. Yeah, you got a bag of shit like right? clap in between. Yeah, a clap. Oh, oh, no! Oh, this one is right head. I was wondering if you've ever given your brother Joel an atomic wedge. Is that even possible? I brought my own goalie. I brought my own too. Here's no. bigger. Oh, wow! Oh, hey, hey, hey. Blue line is when you shoot a shot from the blue sides. line. That's like a long slap shot. Okay. Hey, do you know what a wraparound is? You, <laughs> All right, anyway. Do you know what a fish uh, is? <laughs> well, welcome to the Eli Manning Show presented by Duncan. I'm Eli Manning. Of course, we got Sean No Carbs O'Hare over here. And we got a really, we got a cool show today. It's going to be a lot of fun. What do you want to do today? Do we have a script? I haven't even looked at it. Yeah, I think we've got some special guests today. I think we're going to hear from your brother. Ooh, Not paid. Uh, Kubi's on? Kubi. Where's Kubi? Yeah. Uh, and then we got, you know, Lundquist. How about, I mean. Man, like, you want to talk about an unbelievable all, career. Hall of Famer. Yeah. Holy. How about you on ice? You any good? I've never been dangerous? on ice. Never been on ice in my life. Never been on ice? No. You scared? Yeah, I'm scared. Very, very. That looks like a long fall. <laughs> long fall. Uh, you know what? Let's just get right to it, right? Hey, this guy had an unbelievable career with the Rangers. Uh, he's getting his number 30 retired. He is uh, going to be a Hall of Famer. Uh, unbelievable career, 15 years for the Rangers. So please welcome Henrik Lundqvist. <laughs> What's up, guys? Thank you, Good to see you. Good to see you. Man, dapper. Oh, ah, looking Whoa. good. Looking You're good. On the show, you got to dress up, right? Wow. Yeah. I see my hair looks just like his, right? Yeah. I, I try to get it yeah. like yours. Are we going the same way? Uh, no, you went. Th- you you changed up on me. I think. Oh, really? I, th- yeah. I, looked, I watched some film on you. I <laughs> you thought it was going film? this. Way. Yeah. Oh. I mean, I'm just jealous. We're like <laughs> the same age. We came to New York around the same time. But your hair is so much better than mine, and it was really disappointing to me. (laughs) Great hair. He's got the great beard. I mean, but you you guys were, like, both, like, the most stylish athletes in all of New York City at some point, right? So, I mean, you guys have that in common, right? Look at this guy. He's in Uh, the suit. Yeah. You know? I mean, I think we might need to have a little little walk-off. Might get a little (laughs) right-said Fred playing in the background. I got blue steel. I'll I'll be blue steel. I'm, I'm Zoolander. You can be... Hansel. Does that make me Mugata? Yeah. Name? <laughs> Which one is that? Is that yeah, the old like, guy, the curly hair? That's no, Owen. No, Owen I'm, Wilson. Oh, oh Owen, yeah. Wilson. Or, yeah, Luke, yeah, yeah. I'll be Mugata. Yeah. Yeah, that was Will Ferrell. <laughs> That's yeah. the guy I was thinking of. <laughs> I talked to a uh, one of your teammates this morning and wanted to get a little information. I'm not that, I can't reveal my source, uh, <laughs> uh, Brad Richards. But uh, <laughs> okay. anyway, yeah. uh, he wanted me to ask you about your Swedish shampoo ambassador job oh. that you had at some point. Well, that sounds interesting. It sounds like a good job. We're having a lot of fun with that. And, and uh, I like to try to be a little creative here and there and be part of the process of, of shooting commercials. I've seen you guys do a bunch of stuff. And, <laughs> Uh, you know, hockey for me, like football for you guys, it's super intense and it's one way of thinking and feeling. But when you do other things, it's an opportunity to just relax and have fun with it. So that partnership's been working. It's still working. And speaking of relaxing, he also said you're the only person when y'all had like a late night flight, the team's flying back, coach says, hey, wear whatever you want, sweats. You're still wearing the skins tight suit <laughs> with the tie on, yeah. like fully asleep, just at peace. I mean, that's where you're comfortable. You're comfortable in a suit, yeah, right? Yeah, no, I mean, you don't wear sweats, you're in a suit. <laughs> but uh, obviously, um, getting the jersey retired, right? Unbelievable career, New York Rangers. That's gotta be a, gonna be a special uh, event for you, right? Yeah, it's kind of crazy to think about it, how, how it all happened. There's so many things that you know, I'm grateful for all the friendships and the memories you create with your teammates and the fans. And uh, yeah, it's it's surreal. But I really look forward to that. My family, friends flying in from Sweden to experience it together and be the first time actually I have my entire family in New York at the same time. Yeah, I can't wait. It's going to be amazing. Do you remember that first game you played for the, for the Rangers, that first save maybe? Uh, I do remember... You know, the the crowd and the intensity. And, and uh, I remember they start chanting my name after that first game. First and I couldn't game. believe it. The I first game be- you got the chance. First game. And I was like, well, what's going and- on here? I thought for sure it's going to take me months to, to to get that kind of support. Um, but it happened. And Rick. Oh, yeah. Henrik. Yeah. Henrik. Henrik. There it is. We can get it going. I think it's supposed to be a bag of shit like a clap right? in between. Yeah, a clap. Mm-hmm. 
so when it happened first game at the Garden, I was so shocked and surprised. But, you know, when you come into the league, young player and you're nervous and, and there, there's so much on your mind. But when you start feeling that support early on, it, you know, you start feeling really good about yourself and you get confident and uh, it was amazing to feel that support. We're, we're talking about how similar you guys are. 15 years with one franchise. You mentioned your first game at the Garden, but take us back throughout your career. What, what is the, your most defining moment in that special arena? I'm coming from Sweden. I grew up in a really small town. So to come to New York and play in, in, in a city like New York and for an organization like the Rangers, it was so far from where I grew up. So at times for sure, especially the first couple of years, it was almost like, is this a movie? Is this really happening? <laughs> and then. You know, you, you bring it down. So you start getting comfortable with it and, and you don't want to overthink it or make it too big of a deal. But it, it was so many moments where you had to pinch yourself and uh, just be so grateful that you got to experience that. Are you jealous you know, that as a goalie, you don't get to put your hands under someone's you know, <laughs> inner thighs like this guy every you know, 70 times a game? Is that a, you were, were you ever jealous you didn't get to do No, that? I, oh, yeah, to I'm be sorry. honest, I never really reflected yeah. on that, but uh, I, I did. I'm uh, sure you, you did not miss out on anything <laughs> spectacular. I think everybody's jealous on the ice. You're the only one that has his own little water cooler like on top of the net. Every, if you, somebody wants a drink, they've got to come over. Hey, can I borrow your, your, your gate? Yeah, I didn't like that. I hate when guys ask for my water. It's like, that's my bottle. Don't touch it. Don't touch it. You have your own bottle at the bench. And how's the transition now doing broadcasting, you know, MSG, TNT? Was yeah. That, is that something you, um, you, you get into? Yeah, I do a little media with MSG Networks. I love that. A little yeah. TNT. And, uh, but then I have four or five other projects that I'm working on and that makes me excited. Yeah, you're staying busy, and, and I got to ask you about you're doing great works uh, with your charity, the Henrik Lundqvist Foundation. Uh, what can you tell us about that? Well, um, when I came to New York, uh, the Rangers Foundation, Garden Greens Foundation, they really showed me, you know, what we can do using our platforms, our names in the city, with the connections we have, and. Uh, really the difference we can make. So uh, I became the spokesperson for Garden of Dreams. But after a few years, I also wanted to create my own foundation to be able to uh, give back. So we, we focus on education and health. Uh, it's been a great experience to, uh, you know, work with the different organizations and, and see the impact. I know you have a, a twin brother. Um, you know, last year, my brother Peyton said something mean to me and I gave him an atomic wedgie. Where <laughs> atomics when you get the underwear over the head. And that's, that's impressive. That's a big head. And I was wondering if you've ever given your brother Joel an atomic wedgie. It is a big I, head. I have big not. underwear. Is that even possible? Physically possible. It's got a rip. It's got, it's it's got, got to rip. be some rippage. It's yeah. got to be some rippage. Wow. Uh, I mean, that, that that's, that's kind of like a hockey move, right? You've done guys, that to your brother. Any, the any good fights over. growing up? Um, yeah, uh, for the do, most part, we... Do they still we, happen, though? That's the question. They do not happen, happen but we, we had days where we just had so much energy. You know, we were on oh, yeah. the street every day playing street hockey, but there were times where, like, we looked at each other, it's like, you want to fight? <laughs> Let's fight. And we were just fighting until someone was bleeding, and then we stopped. Then we were friends. Right. But there were definitely afternoons where we just have... Probably we didn't spend enough time playing street hockey, right. so we had too it, much had energy. energy. Yeah. It was like, let's fight. Did you like putting on the mask? Like, did that kind of feel like you were kind of becoming somebody different when that thing went down? Yeah, uh, I don't know if I became different, but it felt like a safe, safe place. I never took it off. Like I see goalies, they take it off and drink. Like my mask stayed on <laughs> the entire game. Uh, and it was kind of cool. like I never really had eye contact with well, fans. Your hair was probably messed up. You don't want to show The hair was actually right? perfect. Yeah, <laughs> maybe, maybe the hair. Uh, that, that's, that's a good... Yeah. Um, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, now we got a, we're going to a little game we call the one minute drill. So in football, okay. you got the two minute drill. It's the last game. I, yeah. in hockey, I'd say the goalie has been pulled to this point. Y'all are up, it's, but it's a shootout. It's a shootout. So we're gonna ask questions, quick, rapid okay. fire answers. Okay. If there's one player from the '94 team that you could have played with, who would it be and why? Uh, Brian Leach. Seems like an uh, unbelievable guy and obviously a great player. Who had the hardest slap shot that you've ever gone against? Uh, I'm going to say Chara. Oh. A big defenseman. It was heavy. It hurt. <laughs> it hurt sometimes, yeah. He's supposed to stay on that end, right? <laughs> yeah. Your uh, favorite moment at MSG? Uh, conference final win, one nothing game. Um, that, that was a big moment.
Love it. Shout out. Shout uh, out. You, yeah, a lot of saves throughout your career. Is there one in particular that you love the most? Um, well, the, there was one there uh, against Montreal in that conference final. Uh, it was a broken play and I managed to get my blocker up. It was kind of a weird save. I had to improvise it a little bit. I have bad memories. I don't remember a lot of saves, but that one I do remember. Who's your biggest rival? Ah, uh, my brother. <laughs> <laughs> it's my biggest supporter and biggest rival Love at the same it. time. No, it, you uh, spend a lot of time on, on, on buses, right? So I'm sure you watch a lot of movies. What's your favorite hockey movie? I remember as a kid, I loved Youngblood. Nice. Yep, probably my favorite hockey movie growing up. Are you related to Vern Lundquist? Um, I don't think so. Okay. There's a similarity. That's one yeah. of the reason I asked. I okay. The, you won. You won the one minute drill, but now we got some gifts. We got some oh. gifts for you. So yeah. We got a. Uh, we got a little jersey. A jersey. We got some Saquon Barkley shoes. So here you go. We need your Giants. Number Love thirty. It. Jersey that's, right that's there. Great. And you get some shoes. Amazing, look at these. Yeah, right. They look fast. They are fast. They yeah. are fast. You can wear them on the ice. Well, you thank you so much. Yeah. I appreciate it. There you go. I brought two jerseys for you guys. Oh, all right. Need to represent, obviously. Let's see if we get the right one here. Oh, no way. There you go. Well, that's there for you. That. You even brought him one? <laughs> yeah, this is awesome. Yeah. Jeez. My first gift of all season. Yeah. yeah. I love look it. That. Look at that. I'm ready. Yeah, I'm gonna put this on. <laughs> Why not? I wanna, I, I wanna, I wanna feel what it's like to have a little, little should, hockey jersey. How does it feel? I think we should play some. How do I feel? Huh? Oh. Wanna play hockey? hockey? Yeah. All right, I'm yes. in. You ready? Really? Yeah. Yeah. We're oh, going. I love it. Let's do it. Let's go. Let's right. go. Where did Sean go? I don't know. All right, boys. Uh, ready to hit the ice? I got some hot chocolate here. I got love some it. skates. We're ready to rock and roll, Thank huh? You. There you go. We're playing air Cheers. hockey. We're not. You th do you think there's a hockey rink out here? <laughs> yeah. We're at a football stadium. Dude, we got Henrik. We got to get on the ice. Where's the ice? I guess it's in the cup. There you go. All right. Cheers. All right, well, yeah. Thank you. All right, boys. You ready to play some air hockey? Let's do First it. One to three wins. Henrik, are you ready? I'm ready. Eli, are you ready? Oh! oh, wow. oh <laughs> Shocker. Yeah. Oh, Henrik, yes. one nothing. Oh, it's coming. Oh, get it oh. there. Look at that. Okay, oh boy. No. Wow. Hey. Henrik, with the cat like reflexes, Eli, what are you doing? You got to guard the goal. Pretty good at I went right down the middle. my shot. How did you stop me? Right. Oh, got it. Eli, oh. On, Eli oh. on the defensive. Whoa. Three, nothing, oh, Well, he's the guest. I think we gotta play the best of three. <laughs> yeah, that was so definitely. quick. All right, yeah. best of three. Let's go. Get in there. Oh, wow. Eli's trying to bring it. Oh, he's Come on. Yes. Wow, one nothing, Eli. All right, Henry. All right, we're playing <laughs> defense or offense right now. Get in. Oh, oh, Eli, what are you doing back right off. now? Two to nothing. No! Oh. I'm no. back. Score. I'm back. Two he's, one. He's alive. No! Oh, oh, wow. wow. Okay. Ooh. Wow. Game two goes to Game Eli. Two. This is it. One to one right now. So the winner takes all right here. Are you ready? Playing to three. You ready? I'm ready. Oh, oh, oh he's taking wow. it off. Good job. Oh, he's Come unbuttoning. Up. You need a sip? You want some hot chocolate? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Eli's playing defense Ooh, right now. Oh, look. He's found look his rhythm. Table. Oh, he shoots, he scores. Yeah. Oh. No! Oh. Suchi scores 1-1. 1-1. 1-1 right now. Ladies and gentlemen. We're no! 2-1! Oh. Oh. Two to 2-1 one. Two to one now. Uh. Oh. Eli hanging on. Oh. No! Oh Whew, what wow. is that? It's all two time. Two. Next score wins. 2-2. Two two. Next over. score wins it all. Oh. <laughs> 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 We have oh. a winner! Oh, Henrik! <laughs> what a battle! Good match. That's a good one. That's good a good match. one. Got a little sweat going. Woo. All right, so now we got a new little game going on. We're gonna play a game called Save It or Say It. Save it or save it. say it. We're gonna take one shot at you. All right. If you save it, you don't have to answer the question. If we make it, we gotta ask you a hard question 
that you gotta do it. We only have uh, three shots. I'll take one, Sean takes one, I take another. All right. Save All right. it or say it. Save it or say it. All right, here we go. Ooh, ooh, ooh. A little fake, a little fake, a little fake. <laughs> All right. All right, you're lucky. You saved one. Hold on a second. What's your brother doing here, Henry? Oh. Oh. I try. Oh, I try. I try to try. distract him a little bit. All right. Oh, oh my God! Oh, that was a wild. Wild. Wow. Okay. Is that I don't know how to play it. Huh? Right. That was that was just practice. That was practice. All right. Last okay. one. Last question. Ooh. What's his weakness, Sean? Does he have any? I don't think so. Man's like a piece of iron. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, but I think we still get to ask one question. The question is, if you could only live in one place and you could never go back to the other place, is it New York or Sweden? Ooh. Oh, this is tough. A lot of people watching this. Yeah. Probably, <laughs> a lot in Sweden. I'm very popular in Sweden. Yeah, so yeah, yeah show, you are. You know, you're. Gets a lot of coverage um, there. That is a tough one. Yeah. I'm going to pick. New York. There you go. New York is my home oh, now. Yeah. yeah. Good answer. Family That's feud. Right. Number one answer right there. There yeah. we go. All right, Henrik. Uh, Sean and I didn't fare too well trying to score on you, so we're going to do the opposite. You're going to try to score on me, except I brought my own goalie. Oh. That's nice. Yes. That's Here. funny enough. I, I brought my own, too. Oh, wait. Let wow. me see. Look, yeah. Yours is no. bigger. Wait. Why is your... Why is your bobblehead bigger than Yeah, that? I don't know. He's already got know. the baseline cover, too. You know, that. that's that's pretty nice, well, right? Actually, if we're going to go that way, I'm going to bring in my secret bobblehead. Secret bobblehead. You call that a bobblehead? <laughs> this Whoa. is a bobblehead. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh. Look at that. Yeah, look at that. Oh, well, don't break it. Don't break it. He's fragile. <laughs> You'll never score on me with this thing. <laughs> All right. Is that one going on the table this or is, how are we playing this? Yeah, it's going to go on the table. So yeah, uh, okay. I think I just win, actually. There's no way you could score on me. So I, I win. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I'll give you this one. <laughs> Henry, thank you so much. Really appreciate it. Thanks for having You're me. You're an awesome. On. Congrats appreciate on your great career in New thank York so with the Rangers. So. Awesome. Thank you. All right, that was pretty cool. Henrik, awesome. H Henrik, a little air hockey. I didn't know you were so bad at air hockey. You were the one that we kept missing. What are you talking about? He I was is on fire. He, you know what? I think I was a little off put. He's so devilishly handsome. I, I, I couldn't focus. But my hair does look a little bit like his, right? Yeah, okay, sure. Yeah, yeah. Right. yeah. good, good. Thank you. All right, now um, one of my favorite segments of the show, a little segment I like to call Where's Coopy? So let's go, Coop! Oh, where are you? What's up, boys? I'm just down in New Orleans enjoying a nice fried shrimp bull boy. Just, it's kind of a rainy day, so nothing wow. like a little, uh, little treat. I'm very jealous again. That looks delicious. Well, Coop, I, well, well. when I think of you in New Orleans two-fisted, that, that's not exactly what I visualize. <laughs> I know. It's too early for any sort of shenanigans. What? You've changed. Coop, when, when we had you on earlier in the year, you said that there was zero chance this show was gonna, you know, make it, and we're, and we're, you know, was not gonna last. Any advice on uh, for me hosting a show? Don't you think I'm probably the best host? I can't think of someone more unqualified to host a talk show. I mean, I think it's made for <laughs> mediocrity at best. This is the final episode of season one. I mean, we made it. Are you surprised? I mean, you want to take back that what you said earlier? Have you seen the contract for season two? Is there one? <laughs> no. Why? I've done more. Se I, I've been in more season ones than anyone in the history of acting. <laughs> Unbelievable season ones. Never heard from again. Uh, great point, so, Coop. It's great to see you again yeah. and and being back on this show. And I think Eli's just trying to make up for the fact that he never had you on the Monday Night Football show with Peyton. What, what's going on with that? How did that happen? And are you still bitter? Truthfully, he told me I was the overtime guy every week, and it just never happened to overtime. So they went in overtime the first well. week. I, I, <laughs> Except the first week. I suggested you I every this, week, but you got vetoed. I, I don't know who I, think, I don't know who vetoed you out, but I I give you a hint. He's not your older brother, and he's not my younger brother. I feel confident in this certain scenario that. My chances are better for a season two because I wasn't on season one. That's what I'm hoping. <laughs>
of course. What are y'all having for lunch today? I had a Dunkin' Donut, you know, for my lunch. Yeah, I'm uh, looking at a salad probably, you know. Th th those carbs look good, but yeah, I'm not, I don't think I can handle that right now without having a nap. Are after you a this. lineman? Are you a lineman and you eat salad? You can't eat a carb? I, I, mean, I do. Really I drink. Change. I drink you, my carbs. You've really changed. I, I drink my carbs. Uh, what's in a salad? <laughs> <laughs> a lot of protein. No liquid. No liquid. So, what do y'all? Um, y'all have any guests today? Or yeah. Too? Yeah. We uh, we just had uh, Henrik Lundqvist on. That's why my hair is like this. Does it look just like Henrik's? Can you see? God, you look like George Hamilton in 1973. Coop, you once told Fantastic. me you once told me that Henrik was related to Vern Lundqvist, but that is not accurate. I know they look very similar, but they that's yeah. different spelling, different hairstyles. <laughs> I remember one time I ran into Vern Lundquist at dinner in Oxford, Mississippi, before Ole Miss game, and he was coming out of a restaurant. I swear he had 15 pounds of like juice on his shirt. He, <laughs> he, I don't think anything ever hit his mouth. Just like just leaking steak sauce. Fantastic! What a legend! What a legend! Well, Coopy, enjoy enjoy the sandwich. Thanks for coming on. Thanks for making us jealous again. Always always doing something much more fun than what we're doing. So. Um, we uh, hopefully we'll see you in season two. Can't wait. Book me for season two. All right, you're done. Cool. Thank Good you, stuff, man. Enjoy the soup. All right, there's Koopy. You know, just eating a fried shrimp po' boy. It just seems like a he's just grinding, right? Just working hard, just grinding every day. <laughs> he is living the life right now. <laughs> I wonder where he's going to go tomorrow for that po' boy. Yeah, no, somewhere, somewhere good. But Shauna, we made it. Yeah, first season. We got it. We got it done. I mean, what an unbelievable year! You I got know. to throw a pass to Kevin Durant. Pretty cool. We got to make fun of Kevin Hart. Kevin, yes. You just got a chance I, to I, beat I, Henrik Lundqvist. I played in air hockey. Air, air hockey, Henrik Lundqvist, basketball, pop a shot with Kevin Durant. Uh, that was exciting. That was an yeah. exciting year. That was pretty cool. We, we got a, 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 a years long subscription to Dunkin' Coffee. <laughs> this is great. I love it, and I think that. Yeah, we should each get one of the pillows. Too, yeah, right? I'll take one. You take one. Okay, it look good right on my bed. Abby will love that. Well, yeah, you know. Uh, but it was, hey, you know what? It was fun being with yeah. you. You're a great, great, great buddy, great pal. I'm what, glad I passed what, the test. You though. passed the test, so <laughs> you're good. But uh, hey, let's take a look at some of the highlights from this year. Let's go. Here we go. Right. Oh, wow. hey, hey, hey. Welcome to the Eli Manning Show. Please welcome Tracy Morgan, Henrik Lundqvist, Kevin Durant, my brother, Peyton. Peyton, why are you listening to that psycho? We gotta teach you how to eat with a spoon, man. You're gonna twirl it into the spoon. Ah, oh, you know, I'm coachable. I'm your valet, I'll, I'll park it for you, don't worry about it. If I was a superhero, I would be the opposite of a giant. A small person, so you just be yourself. Eli Manning. This would fit you, Vic. Size, it says Vic. Eli, are you ready? Oh, oh, Eli, oh, oh, oh. he's the guest. Yeah, you know, I don't want to embarrass nice him. Idea. Eli called me and said he wants to be on the show. And Eli never called me back. I came just four days of practice. We got Tom young. Brady. He missed that practice. This Whoa. is a bobblehead. <laughs> son. Son. Can I get a sentence, please? You, you son, Tom Brady, son. Oh, son, son, son. 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 You know what I'm saying? Oh, I did wow. twice. <laughs> oh, my. And the original story of Stripes was written for Cheech and Chong. I can't imagine Cheech telling Sergeant Holka that he was his big toe. Oh, is you a great one? This is a real show. Hey Giants fans, Eli Manning here. You want to see more videos? Subscribe now to our YouTube channel.